What's going on everybody? Elio Trades here with a little message to you guys, the crypto community on my birthday. And it's a really opportune moment to look back and reflect because exactly one year ago, I was almost exclusively focused on game development, releasing video games as the only you know, viable product in crypto land after pretty much three years of dead heartbeat uh, in the altcoin space. We did get some excitement from Bitcoin in 2019, some IEOs and exchange tokens, uh, but it wasn't really a validation of crypto native projects. And then we got the explosion of DeFi and the world turned to blossoming new projects, excitement, innovation, and attention in the crypto space. And really the growth that I've made personally, the amount of work, the amount of channel growth, the amount of uh, you know steps forward, allies I've built, uh, teams that have risen up, friends I've made in the last 12 months is almost hard to count, hard to calculate and quantify. It's been insane. And when I look back at what happened just the space of a year, it makes me not only optimistic, but it makes me so sure of where this crypto movement is headed. And even though the markets are reeling from a crash, the reality is that sitting here at $30,000 Bitcoin with a trillion dollar market cap, I mean, these things were unthinkable uh, just a few months ago. And to think of how far we've come in such a short time, it should really be a sign that innovation comes in fits and starts and the attention as far as the actual price will definitely come in mania phases and phases of you know pure desolation and bear euphoria, bull euphoria. But what doesn't stop is actually the progress. And what we saw actually this time was that the progress moved so fast that again, the infrastructure couldn't really hold the weight. And we ended up you know getting pushed out of Ethereum, which is where everyone wanted to be to other chains. And what I do believe would be this sort of blessing in disguise, which is this current you know receding of the passions of the bull market, is that over the next few months, we're gonna see deployments of some of the most important scaling infrastructure in the entire crypto space. We have Immutable X doing uh, ZK rollups for NFTs on Ethereum. It's super easy to use. Polygon is integrating even closer with Ethereum. We have Arbitrum coming very soon. We have ZK rollup based optimism and all kinds of magical scaling solutions coming to Ethereum. EIP 1559. We have Polkadot. We have all these amazing innovations coming into this industry right now. And really, over the next few months, this entire infrastructure could be given a fresh coat of paint that will make the next wave even that much more sustainable, that much more long lasting. Well, we really don't even know what's possible because I couldn't have predicted this DeFi mania if you could have. But now we see the likes of Mark Cuban and Kevin O'Leary, Mr. Wonderful, making their own DeFi projects and getting involved in NFTs. We saw some of the biggest celebrities in the world doing NFTs. And really, I never imagined that NFTs or NFT infrastructure, NFTs as a medium, as a technology would be this mainstream this soon. I can only see this as an advancement of probably five years ahead of where I thought we We'd be. And I do believe that the, you know, the golden goose, the, uh, the white buffalo, the ultimate realization of NFTs with video games is still very much something we're looking forward to. So I believe strongly that right now is one of the most optimistic and exciting times that has ever existed in crypto land with prices that are much cheaper than they were just a few days ago on assets that people would have begged to get into cheaper just a few weeks ago. And the reality is that this is how it goes. It gets overexcited, then it gets underexcited. And reality is always somewhere in between. So my message to you guys is that the last year has been pure magic. It has seen exponential growth in this industry, and we're in a correction from that. But this doesn't mean that it's time to turn off and go away. If anything, it's time to dig your heels in and try to figure out how you can power the next wave of this movement. I felt the exact same way in 2018. And I'm not saying that this is going to be another 2018. Again, nothing has exactly resembled the past. So why would this bear market that we're in resemble previous bear markets? It just won't be that way. But I believe strongly that if you really love this industry, if you really believe in it like I do, that it's time for you to dig your own heels in and figure out how you can contribute. Not just trading tokens, but figure out if you can provide something that will help bring more users in, that will create more adoption uh, for crypto, for blockchain, whichever are the joy buttons that you find most interesting, most disruptive. Right now is a time for optimism, for growth, even if the markets look pretty awful. And so I just want to leave you with this message that today, looking back at the last year and everything that's been accomplished 
and looking forward at the next year, I am so excited. I'm actually coming out of my skin with excitement because I know the best is yet to come. And I do believe strongly that what we're building, what we're doing here will echo into infinity, disrupting these power structures, not just in one industry, not just in uh, finance, uh, not just the industry of gold, but the industry of video games, of art, of music, of all kinds. And it's just the beginning. So if you guys are excited about innovation, about potentially once in a lifetime opportunities, I mean, this movement is not just once in a lifetime, it's once in you know a millennia, this type of change. And I think it's quite a privilege to be a part of it. And I hope that even though things look pretty bad, uh, you're able to look back and reflect on just how far this industry has come in such a short time. So thank you to everyone who supported the channel, who supported my projects. The best is yet to come with all of these things. And I am so excited to keep doing the work I'm doing and see this industry just completely blossom over the coming months and years. So thank you guys. I hope you guys are having a happy and healthy weekend. Uh, don't let the bear get you down. There's always some more bullish mania, amazing euphoria in the future, that I'm sure. That said, thank you guys uh, so much, and I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.